previously on Finkel Media. Supervisor. How you doing? Hey, can I help you? Uh, no, I'm, I'm good. Can, can I ask uh, what the purpose of your visit is? Uh, I'm just taking pictures. Uh, just for your own personal use? Yeah, a uh, B-roll for a story I'm doing. Okay, so you see this is a government facility. Yeah, yeah. Can I see your identification, please? Oh, no, I'm good. Oh, she's not really sure. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm uh, taking pictures. Uh, the signs, the gate, the building. Well, now you. <laughs> Not off the ride with family, alright? Please keep six feet or more. That's about three feet. I need six feet. I'm gonna give us six feet and you're gonna maintain it, okay? That's put about six feet. Down, you need to back off. No, you need to put your camera I'm down. I'm in a public space and you are violating well, my Well, you are violating my space, but no, you approached me. me. I'm here in public. You approached me. Don't point Back your the finger fuck at out. me because... Say what? Back the fuck off. Hey, look. You you don't come up here and tell me to do that and you film me. I'm in public space. I've... As quest for a bacon double cheeseburger, David Finkel did not get a bacon double cheeseburger from the Arlington police. He did not get a bacon double cheeseburger from the Army National Guard. He did not get the bacon double cheeseburger from the security for the Army National Guard, nor the plainclothes security. David Finkel failed to get a bacon double cheeseburger from the security for the Department of State or the plainclothes guy. Stay tuned in part three to see if I get my bacon double cheeseburger. Just all the videotaping. Taking pictures. Oh, why, why, why are you taking pictures? Personal use, maybe a story. What type of story? Uh, can't disclose it yet. 
Huh? Can't disclose it yet. You can't disclose it yet? No. Be about, you know. Yeah, well, if I'm on post, I can't take pictures unless I have permission. Yeah. I'm not on post. What's your name? Uh, good citizen. Good citizen? Yeah. So. Who are you? Huh? Who are you? Um, oh, I'm the law enforcement on, on the installation there. Oh, okay. Did you know you're off the installation right now? Yeah, I do. I know. Okay. I'm, have a good day. I answer. There. Okay. What I else? I have a care and concern about you know anybody that you know is probing uh, my installation. Your I'm installation? So Are you I, the commanding officer here? I, I'm not commanding, but I work here. So you work here. So well, yeah, so what do you do here? There's a care and concern. I just told you what I did. Oh, you're law enforcement. So I just I just told you what I did. Law enforcement. So I, so I have a care and concern because I mean, okay. If you're probing my installation, why should not come out here and ask you questions as to why? I have no problem with you asking questions. My installation. What else do you want to know? So, I mean, that's it. I mean, you okay. Tell me what, I just asked, what type of story would you possibly? Be oh. There's a lot of competition in the press, so I, I don't want to let it get it out until I'm ready to release it. You, you work for the press? You're an independent guy? What, I mean... I am press according to the First Amendment of the United States Constitution. How are you doing, specialist? Okay. I, mean, I just got to get a warm and fuzzy. Are, are you active duty out of uniform? or? What's that? Are you active duty out of uniform? I'm a civilian. You're a civilian? Mm -hmm. When you sign up for this job, do you take an oath to the Constitution? Did I what? You take an oath to the Constitution. Oh, okay. So you're familiar with the First Amendment? I, listen, I'm familiar. I'm, I'm, I'm retired military. Cool. I'm oh, good. I check all the boxes. Thank you for your service. Thank you. Yes. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, if you go to any any military installation and you're outside and you're them in the gate, I would be very surprised anyone that wouldn't come out. Can you think of an installation that's more it. secure than this? What's that? Can you think of an installation that's more secure than this? Uh, well, I'm not concerned about that. I've taken installation. pictures of the Pentagon. So. I've taken pictures of NORAD. I've taken pictures of the White House. Are you more secure than the White House? I'm not saying I'm not. I'm not saying I am. So. <laughs> you're not. So. Uh, if, if I could stand in public ground and take pictures of the White House, I'm not saying the that. Pentagon, I'm just NORAD. I'm asking you a question as to why. Okay. I mean, I have a... I it's, mean, it's for a story. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, have a, I have a serious concern to say if you tell me you're videotaping, you know, my installation, what have you, and I don't know, maybe two Do you have a days, smartphone? Two or three days, what? Do you have a smartphone? Do I have a smartphone? Yeah. I don't. Oh. Well, I'm sure you have an office with a computer. Uh, yes. Go to Google Maps, go to Satellite View, and you'll see that you can get more information about this post than I can from the sidewalk. I, 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 I know all of that. <laughs> Trust uh, me, I do. If I was probing, I'd do it from Google Maps I, and never be I know, seen. Or I'd come by at night, well, and, and I'd just use this one. Well, I, it's just that you make things so obvious or what have you. Right. I, I, obvious, plain day. Yeah. I let yeah, them take true. my picture. I, mean, I got nothing to hide. That's true. But Except I mean, for my competitors. They don't need to know about my story. Your, your competitors? Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm just, what, 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 what is the competition out there about military installations that... You oh, it's not them. installations in general. It's it's any kind of uh, media story. So what, yeah. what, what type of story could you generate from this installation? Uh, uh, stories of public interest. Like? Can't go into the details well, right no, now. But you, you can't tell me that you can just look at this installation here and generate a story without knowing Oh, this is what we call B-roll. As I, as I formulate the, the story right. in, in text, I get B-roll so the audience can see a little bit about what I'm talking know, about. Tell me, can you tell me one thing? Tell me one thing about this installation. What can you tell me? Because I ask people like in general. It's a, it's a National Guard training center. Okay. I can't tell if it's co-located with the State Department. You guys seem to be having different security systems. I don't know. How you doing, Sergeant? How you doing? Uh, okay. But I, I'll, I'll find that out as I do more research. Okay. Right. Yeah. Uh, if, if you guys are the same installation, you probably get together and communicate and coordinate. I really don't know if you are or not. Wow, that's loud. Well, yeah, I just find that interesting that yeah. you know, you're doing a story and, and things like yeah. that. And if, if I need more information directly from them, I'll go to the, I'm sure you have a public uh, affairs office yeah. or there, something similar there, to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are you part of the military yourself? You seem, I am. You yeah. seem to know, you know. I got uh, four years Navy, two and a half years National Guard, and ten years Army. So, ten years to Army. Army. Infantry. Oh, okay. <laughs> Infantry? Yeah. Where's yeah. the station? Ah, uh, wow. Uh, Fort Stewart, Fort Benning, Fort Campbell, Fort Polk, Camp Casey, Korea, 
Schweinfurt with deployments to Panama in 88, 89, Bosnia in 96. Uh, that's just the Army side. The Navy, I was on the USS Cunningham, uh, 80, 88. And you too, sir. Are you retired? Or? No, no, I didn't. No? Now, the IT, IT was really good when I got out, so I, I jumped. Yeah, but you sound I chased like the money. You did quite some years. Over 10? Uh, you, uh, 14 of federal active service on, and another. 14 years and can't stick out the other six or 20 years. <laughs> it's not a matter of not sticking it out. It's, it's, I, get, mean, you, I understand you saying. Specialists tell me, do you get paid enough? I do. You, you get paid enough? I do. BAQ and VHA must be good well, around here. Well, <laughs> back I didn't get paid enough. Back in the days yeah. When, when, yeah, when we were there, uh, I can remember my check then. So Most there's, of the, there's a difference from back yeah. then in the uh, late, I was in the late 80s. Late 80s, late 80s good. 80s, to, to where he's at today. Yeah. You know, so he said he's happy with his pay. Yeah. I'm still not happy with mine. I'm sorry? I said he said he's happy with his pay. I said yeah. I'm still not happy with mine. I, I bet you're but, single, aren't you? I bet you're single, aren't you? Oh, I, I was, when I was in E4, I was uh, married with, Two kids and one on the way. I had a third one when I was a sergeant. Okay. Most of the time, I qualified for food stamps. Of course, not in Germany and not in Korea, but okay. actually my family qualified for food stamps when I was in Korea. So yeah, so if you're getting food stamps, you're not getting paid enough. <laughs> but anyway, in 98, when I got out, mm -hmm. the IT business was booming. And all I did was play with some Windows uh, 3.1 and Windows 95, and they sucked me right up and overpaid me. Okay. <laughs> Meanwhile, my brother was uh, really riding the cash cow in AOL. I was, I was hoping to get into AOL, but uh, okay. all the good guys got that. <laughs> okay. all right. we're, we're I can understand the yeah. need that opportunities were there for you to make more money and yeah, yeah. this and that. And good good, good money. Okay. Uh, and, and quite honestly, my ex-wife uh, wasn't helpful to my career. Oh, okay. You know how first sergeant said, you have to have a power of attorney for your wife. And turn around when the wife would bounce checks at the PX. Sergeant Fink. Okay. Sergeant blah, blah, blah. You're responsible for your wife. For Sergeant, you made me get a power of attorney for her. Right, right, right. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, well, uh, I'm not going to hold you up yeah. or anything. I'm on a, no 5.56, no 7.62. It's just all passive stuff. Is that automatically recording or are you pushing the Yeah, th this is recording and going up to the cloud. This records sometimes where I ran out of battery, so I'm not recording you from here now, but this, this probably is picking you up. That aim's high. I don't know. I might, I might get the glow of your nice shiny head. <laughs> uh, All right. Well, fair enough. All right. I mean, fair enough. So, uh, enjoy, I guess, the rest of your day. Sorry? I say enjoy the rest of your day. Oh, you too, sir. Whatever else it brings for you. Okay. Thank you. Take, Take care, care, guys. Right. Oh, <laughs> they had me well covered. <laughs> so in this three-part video, between all of the civilian uh, security, all of the uniformed military security, the Arlington police. I think I was asked if they could help me six, seven, maybe eight times. <clears throat> it's after lunchtime and I still did not get a bacon double cheeseburger. The service in this joint sucks.